Hey, what's up guys? How's it going? <clears throat> Happy New Year. Um, am I allowed to say that? It's, it's, is there like a time frame on, on when you can say Happy New Year? Um, or is it just depending on when I've seen you? I think there's a time frame. Anyway, Happy New Year. And I wanted to talk to you about New Year's resolutions, especially those around fitness. Now, um, I think it's wonderful that loads of people had that New Year's motivation to, um, you know, better themselves and uh, write out some goals. So if you haven't, um, now's a great time to adjust those New Year's resolutions. Um, it's really, it's really important that you might have hit a snag already and you might sort of be feeling like you want to give up. Um, I can't remember, there's some crazy statistic about how many people join the gym in January and how many people fall off uh, by February. So um, these are a few tips on uh, what to do, if that's you, uh, what to do if you're struggling, and a few tips that uh, I seem to uh, see applicable to people every year for this reason. So firstly, it's really important to set a goal. If you go to the gym and you don't really know what you're doing, it can be a very overwhelming place, especially a new gym, um, especially if it's the type of gyms with, with uh, new equipment or without trainers, without teachers, uh, without classes, then it can just be a very overwhelming place. You're surrounded by people that know what they're doing and they might be huge and it's a bit intimidating. So uh, also without a goal, um, you kind of float around and you don't really make progress. It's also important to track um, the workouts that you do so that you can see progress. Uh, setting a goal is also a great way to motivate yourself. For example, uh, if you've got a wedding that you're um, preparing for, you know, or you have a set weight in mind, then uh, you know you can you can check your weight every few days, every week, and it, it gives you something to work towards. It gives you motivation uh, for the work that you put in, and you see results. Um, and all those things will really uh, give you purpose and focus uh, rather than just floating about the gym and, and having a very general idea of what you want. Like, I'm going to go to the gym three days a week. Okay, that's a very general idea, but you might just go and you might be on your phone and you might not uh, spend much time actually working out. You're spending more time faffing about. So if you have very specific goals, um, the more specific, the better, sort of certain, certain lists. Um, you know, maybe you want to be more flexible, then that's fantastic. I also recommend um, to work on things that you don't like to do. So if you're a big lifter, you know, work on some flexibility. If you're great at yoga, maybe work on uh, some strength stuff this year. Try to change it up um, so that you're more balanced and you don't have muscle imbalance issues that may become a problem as you're older. Um, we're looking for long-term health. Uh, so yes, set goals. Now, this one is really, really important because I saw it when I was a trainer and I still see it every single year. People set goals, it's the beginning of the year, they're super motivated, um, they go hard the first few sessions, then they're incredibly sore, and then they don't wanna go back. So my biggest advice is take it easy. You set some goals, but don't go ham. Make consistency your goal this month, not going straight for those goals. So just be consistent. Just be like, like if you go um, and the first few weeks you're actually gaining weight, don't worry. The most important thing is that you're going, you know, three times a week, four times a week, five times a week, whatever, whatever you set. And what you want is you want to build that routine in January. What do they say? Something like 30 days to build a habit. So just, just get in good habits this month. Take it really easy on yourself and um, build a good solid platform for the rest of the year. So set some goals, but make consistency your key. Um, and that's about it. That's all I wanted to share with you in this video. Um, and I do aim to be more consistent with you as well in making these as I've got a top of a load of topics I want to cover. If there's anything that you want to talk about, um, 
specifically uh, culturally related um, is what the topics that I'm, I'm aiming to cover. But if anything at all you wanna you wanna talk about, whether it's like fitness, use New Year's resolutions, um, uh, Christmas traditions is something I might cover. Um, then do like, comment, and let me know in the comment section. Have a great start to the year. Bye.